is gonna be a super short video. I, I almost didn't want to make this a tone video because it's so uh, just quick and, and dirty, but I'm gonna be doing something to the exterior of the car and arguably some of you guys might might think it's stupid. I, I think it looks cool in some cars. And let's go in front of the car and I'll show you what I mean. It is almost 90 degrees outside with no shade, so excuse me if I look like a pig or something. So by the title of this video, you already know what I'm doing. So effectively, we're gonna be removing the driver's side windshield wiper and then angling the passenger uh, windshield wiper up a couple inches and making it look like a race car, I hate using that term, but that's exactly what I'm gonna be doing. And if you're asking yourself why, I think it just looks cool. Um, you might think it's silly. You, you are deleting 50% of your windshield wiper. Uh, let's see if I can do it with the hood closed. To remove this guy, we just pop this open. There we go. And whatever that is, I'm assuming it's a 14. Yes, it is a 14, wow. Make sure you don't uh, destroy your windshield with this. It's a little difficult with uh, one hand. But there we go, I did it. I didn't even have to uh, open up the hood. It's crazy. For safe keepings. Cool, so now let's do the, the main side, which same thing, has a cover that we can just pop open. Super easy. And now we don't need to take this off, we just loosen it and then angle it as desired. So angle it up a little bit, as aggressive as you want. You can actually go right in the middle if you want, but uh, when you turn on a windshield wiper, it's gonna over rotate and hit the side. So I I'm just gonna do a little, a little bit. There we go, just, to, just enough. The reason I'm doing this is just purely for looks. Like I mentioned, it's kind of silly because you're taking off one windshield wiper and uh, I like when uh, people put stickers around here. Uh, I don't know, so I moved it that much. Uh, I think that should be plenty. So I'm gonna tie it up and then uh, we'll test, see if it over rotates, which it should be fine, I think, just a couple inches. Now, it's not good for your wipers to actually uh, function without any water because it kills the blades. So I'm gonna get some water real quick just so I can put it on the windshield so I can help it uh, slide better. Oh, in here. Uh, let's see how this single wiper does. Power. See, that's not bad. Although, I think we, we have, you know, that much, so I'm gonna go a little bit higher when I do. And then that's where it looks like when it's resting. So, not too bad, not too bad. Perfectly centered right around here, so I think I can move it just a little bit where it doesn't hit the edge, but yeah. So after the last clip, I, I had a change of heart and I wanted to spray paint this because it looks pretty faded. And you can see there's a lot of uh, polishing compound on the actual, uh, I think it's called a cowling, windshield trim cowling, cowl. It just doesn't look good. Um, everything looks better with the fresh uh, coat of paint. So I took this off, I didn't record it, but uh, pretty simple, just a bunch of clips that's uh, that they're under here. So it, it's pretty easy. Looks like mine was taken off before, so it's, it was already mangled <laughs> a little bit. So I'm gonna clean this off, try to get some of the, uh, the dirtiness out of here and give it a coat of paint. you saw that in the time lapse but people are actually mowing the yard while I was spray painting this so uh, I'm hoping some uh, not a lot of things got shot up into this thing when I was painting it but I'm gonna put it back on then uh, yeah I'll be great I'll be great and I was actually working on Danielle's uh, bumper she has a charger and uh, she got a new bumper so I was sanding it and prepping that up too um, but yeah that's 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 it, that's it. and done okay maybe maybe not but and then these clips go in. 
that was quite the process. Uh, but it looks a lot better now. It's, it's dusty because everything out around the cowling was dusting. So dusty. It's gonna do great. It looks a lot better than it was. Now the original reason we started this video, I'm just gonna put on the one windshield wiper, uh, double check it, make sure the uh, the full, I guess, swing doesn't hit the side of the, the car. So let's do that real quick. Okay, let's check it one final time. And it doesn't hit. And doesn't it? Four fingers here, about three fingers here. So essentially I could move it another inch, which I'm probably gonna do. All right, final test. Let's do, let's do this quickly because I'm, I'm burning up, so. Awesome. So it stops about that much. And when it rotates, about give or take, it's almost center. So I'm gonna call that a win. The final touch is right here. Just look at that. Now my car looks slightly broken, <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I, I was showing Danielle, I was telling Danielle what I was doing and she thinks it's so pointless. And, and I agree with that, it just <laughs> looks kind of silly, not gonna lie. And when you sit down, all you can see is windshield wipers. <laughs> it's fine. Um, uh, and the reason I did this is because I like when cars put stickers uh, around the windshield wiper. I don't know, it just, just looks cool. I actually had to step out of the sun because it's really, really hot right now and I'm just sweating and I couldn't really see anything. I want to thank you guys for watching. This is a super, super easy mod you can do to your eyes through hunt or any other car, really. It's really <laughs> silly. It's kind of out there. And I don't know, you always see drift cars with that one windshield wiper. I just think it looks really cool. Obviously, it's, it's more for aesthetics. Um, I wouldn't recommend it if you live in a place that rains all the time. And uh, I think in some states, windshield wipers are mandatory, but you still got one, right? Just careful if you do that. I'll see you in the next video. Bye. <laughs>